13th round with your main man, Kenny Caraway. Shout out to Jordan Brand, my people over there. Shout out to the dope ones. And as always, I already drunk my bottle today, so I don't even have one for you. But shout out to Cola Seamoss. Big ups uh, to my people over there at Cola Seamoss. I had that fine apple, pineapple today. That's my one. That one and the strawberry lime, those are my two favorites. But go to colaseamoss.com. Go check that out. Go copy some as well. Today, you know we got to talk about it, man. Come on, man. It's it, it, it's it's special. It's special what we got to talk about right now, man. Because we got Errol Spence, we got Bud Crawford. They're on their press tour right now, and man, I watched that press conference from LA. I said, "Oh man, this is crazy." Like, like I'm not even gonna lie to you. It almost felt surreal to see these two finally sitting there talking about a fight that they're about to have. And then, you know, I think about the fight and I think about the stipulations. I think about what's going on. These guys have signed a, an automatic rematch clause. So we're going to get at least two of these things, maybe the trilogy. And these two are the baddest, man. I know a lot of people talk about the U6 and they talk about the Canelos and they talk about the Inaways and all that. No disrespect. No disrespect to those guys. They are great fighters. They are pound for pound top guys, no doubt about it. But for my money, these two are the best. This is the true fight to see who's the number one fighter in the world. Now, I was trying to think about it. Like, when was the last time we got, like, one versus two, you know, for number one pound for pound fighter? I'm th maybe you guys can let me know. Hit me in the comments. Uh, hit me on Twitter, at IMK Diddy. But it feels like it was Canelo Triple G, I think. And then before that, I can't even remember. This is iconic, man. Spence, Crawford. I'm going to talk about it so many more times um, leading up to this fight. But one thing that stuck out for me on the press conferences, Errol Spence, much bigger guy than Bud Crawford. Once again, big fish going to handle business. Spence, by unanimous decision. I'm saying it right now. We'll see, though. It's 13th round. 